Hello and welcome to the GeoPoker channel. Hope you are doing well. Um, quick announcement. I will be very busy in the next two weeks, which means I will not be able to upload videos uh, this week and next week. So this will be the last one um, until 15th of March. Um, there's going to be an episode of Score and Explore on Sunday because that's already recorded. But apart from that, I have to take a two week break. Um, after that, I will probably also introduce a new schedule with some new formats. So you can look forward to that. But for now, let's focus on an urban world. No moving where last time around I came very close to the perfect score. So of course now the goal is to get the perfect score. For that, of course, you need, you know, you need the stars to align. You need those five rounds in a row where you really have good clues. So let's see if today's the day. You can play along as always. And here we go. Okay. Spanish most likely is it not or looks spanish to me or is it i'm not entirely sure yet um well we are in south or central america are we not um, license plates are a bit inconclusive. Um, maybe we're in Central America. I'm not sure yet. I'm just trying to figure out is this Spanish or not. It looks Spanish, but it's, I don't think it is. No, it's not. It's Portuguese. Because there are some, some words, some small details that just don't sound very Spanish to me, like in Spanish this would be a Y, it would be audio E video, for example. Um, and there's a few other things. I just, I can't see one of those characteristic Portuguese um, letters uh, that oftentimes give it away, like the little um, squiggle above the A or something like that. You know what I mean. That's not there, but I think we're in um, Brazil. Uh, yeah. Don't know which city though. There's not really any clue towards that. Can't see it here. Which is a bit annoying. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go into Brazil and I don't know. I really don't know. I wait, can we see one of those state um, abbreviations? You know, like in the US, they have these abbreviations, like these two letter abbreviations for their states. Can I see one like that? I believe not. Nope. Ah, you know what? Let's not waste any more time. I am going to go in ah, into Salvador. Whatever. Let's just try that. Let's go fairly central. Oh, not too bad. We were in Rio, as a matter of fact. Um, all right, then. Not too bad. I mean, the perfect score is certainly out the window, but let's see. We can still have fun with this. I mean, I'm not just playing it to get a perfect score. It's just for the fun of it, of course. Um, but beating certain goals can sometimes be an extra motivation. Um, yeah, we're in Eastern Europe. And I think there's little doubt about that. There's Cyrillic writing here, so it might just as well be Russia. Um, white license plates, which also speaks for Russia. Um, three gentlemen having a little discussion right here. Um, yeah, 
Yeah, I think we're in Russia. And I think it's pretty northern, to be honest. And I completely based that on this brick building. There's not much more thought behind it than that. So I'm going to go into an outskirt of St. Petersburg. Um, yeah, we have an intersection here. More or less like north-south, east-west uh, street grid. Um, maybe down here. Let's try that. And it was completely almost as south as possible. Well, okay. <laughs> uh, yeah. Yeah, that brick building <laughs> was certainly a bit misleading. Um, okay, then. Well, it's a typical rush, I guess. At least it wasn't somewhere over here. Um, this is Japan. <laughs> Don't even need the uh, the image to be completely loaded. Um, now, again, with Japan, there's always one main question. If you cannot read the script, which I can't. Um, is it northern or is it southern? Um, this one doesn't have particular clues towards any of the two. It doesn't look super southern, it doesn't look super northern. Um, we see... Mm, well, we see one AC over here. Um, but generally not too many. I'm not sure how much of a clue that is. But it's not the hottest of places, I think. Otherwise, there would be more ACs and maybe the odd palm tree in the background or something. So I think we're fairly central in Japan. Um, I'm even, you know what? I'm just going to go for Tokyo. I'm just going to go for Tokyo. Um, let's see. Maybe somewhere over here. Let's just go with that. Okay, it was on the east coast in Niigata. All right then. Pretty good points for uh, Japan. So that's cool. And round four. Um, Amedo Center. Oh, this is, a, this is an interesting one. Okay, so we are in Africa in the Eldoret branch. So that's either the city or the street. Probably the city. Um, what more do we have over there? Okay, we're in Kenya. Beautiful. Bank of Baroda. It's not an Indian bank? Not sure. Um, anyhow, we're in Kenya. Then we're probably in Nairobi. So maybe Eldoret is a street or a city quarter. Um, so let's go into Kenya. Let's go into Nai... No, never mind. Eldoret is the city. Haha. -ha. Okay, so... All I need to do now is look for the Gulf African Bank and the Baroda Bank, which are probably in the center. I would assume Central Bank of Kenya. Nope, that's not the one. Um, but it's probably somewhere around here. We have the Paramount Bank over there. Mm, where is the big street. That looks like a fairly big road. There is a well roundabout over here and that is towards the north. So it, yeah, see something like this. Is there a roundabout here? Nope. But it could be on this street. We have the cooperative bank. Plenty of banks for sure. Maybe I have to go one zoom level down. Interesting, also we have a Gurdwara here, we have a Hindu temple here. Quite a <laughs> religiously diverse place this is. Interesting. Um, but I cannot find the banks just yet. Equity bank we have. 
We have a little roundabout over here. Uh, they even named the road after Harambe. <laughs> just a joke, just a joke. Um, another bank? Come on, how many banks do they have? That's crazy. Oh, come on. This shouldn't be so hard to find, right? Maybe I'm not in the right place. Maybe it's further down the road. I have to find this place now. I'm sorry if I'm boring you, but like with these many clues, I have to just be bang on right in the, you know, in the exact location, basically. This is enough clues to get the place. Um, so I'm a bit confused why I can't find any of these banks. Surely they're in the center. Come on. Again, it's the Baroda Bank over there at the roundabout and the Gulf African Bank just to the south of it. That should be possible to find. Come on. Ah, there it is, the Bank of Baroda. Beautiful. That means... Wait. Oh no, wait, did I confuse north and south? No, I didn't. Okay, so the Bank of Baroda is here. Ah, there we go. Here's the Amido Center. And for some reason, the Gulf African Bank. It's not on the map. Maybe this is old imagery. Don't know. However, this should be pretty... Oh, this is... Look at that. That's the Gurdwara right here. <laughs> I was right in front of it, actually. Okay, yeah, we are about here. That should be fine. Yep, 5,000 points. Last round. What do we have here? Hmm... Could be Thailand. Uh, we have a metro here. It looks like a metro system or ah, it could be a flyover. No, it's a flyover. Um, I would have preferred a metro because that would really narrow down to very few cities. What do we have here? Nothing that I can read. Um, here maybe? Now, but that is that a Thailand flag? Not sure. I have a feeling we're in Thailand, and judging by the size of the city, I have a feeling we're in Bangkok. Um, so I'm just gonna look for a flyover. That's pretty much what I'm gonna do. And once I have found one, then I'm gonna look for a Chinese restaurant right next to it. That's my strategy, that's what I'm gonna go with. Um, yeah, it's a pretty big street, a pretty big flyover. Um, sure, I could find something like that. Um, or an expressway. Uh, it takes a little bit of a turn here, right? Just a tiny bit towards the right. Mm. Could be here. You see here, it's going like this, and then it just takes a tiny bit of a right turn here. Could all or here again. Um, so I'm gonna go along this one, which I believe must be a flyover. Yep. And I'm just gonna look for a Chinese restaurant. This is. Yes, nah, don't think that's right. Could it be this one? I mean, what, what do we have here? We have a fairly large building here, like an office building. Um, and then there is a driveway and then there is the big street, basically. So that doesn't quite fit. Maybe here. Mm. Not so sure. Hmm. 
maybe down here. Ah, this one's not that easy. I think this area here, th this seems right, it seems right. You know what, I think I'm gonna go for that restaurant over here. I think that could be right. Let's try that. How far was I away? Ah, it was the right street, but it was up here. Ah, dang, okay. All right then, but still okay points. Um, there we go. Not a bad score. It was really the uh, the Russia one that uh, screwed me over a bit, but altogether, I think it was all right. Um, yeah, hope you liked the video, and I'll see you in uh, two weeks with another episode of an urban world. No moving. Until then, have a good time. Bye-bye.